Guess who's back, 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 back again. Again, again. Guess who's back, back, back with less hair. Well, I suppose that's just me. I can't really say that all the word nerds have less hair than and last quarter, but uh, we are all back. <laughs> Welcome back, Word Nerds, for our first video of the year. The Word Nerds gonna be talking about our quarter one goals. As always, we are going to talk about our goals for the first quarter of 2020. My goal is super exciting. My goal is to have my podcast launch on a strong start. If you did not know, I am launching a podcast. It launches on February 5th, and I am so excited, I cannot wait. My big goal for the first quarter of 2020 is to figure out the basics of script writing. I don't really know how far I'm going to take this goal, but I'm thinking for the first three months, I'm just looking at how do I actually do this? What is the formatting? What are the basics I should know? And then hopefully I can continue to grow from there through the rest of the year. I ended our last quarter of 2019 really strongly. I am very happy with how it went. I just about finished up all of my revisions, and so I have one goal and one goal only, and that is to re-enter the query trenches. Yay. This has been my goal for a few months now, but I really do think that it's going to happen this quarter. I want to finish the first draft that I've been working on since the end of 2018. My goal is to hopefully finish it towards the beginning of the quarter so that I have time to take a break and do a read-through and start on revisions before this quarter is over. I have two goals this quarter the first of which to actually sneak in some more creative writing because I've done a lot of academic writing lately and a lot of planning type writing so I think some actually story based writing would be good for me and secondly because I'm going to be taking a writing class this semester I would like to look at the stuff I've already written and see if any of that sparks uh, any creativity for future assignments it's not cheating it's just getting inspired my main goal for this quarter is to just write more. I feel like I've left writing behind me for the last little while and I really want to get back into it and plus my whip needs some attention. My first quarter goal is to start leaning away from Twitter and start building up my Instagram platform instead in the lead up to release for Witches of Ash and Ruin both because I really actually like Instagram and the format in which it's laid out and Twitter sucks up all of my writing time and that needs to stop so that's my my goal for this quarter. We'll see how that goes. As for how last quarter went, well, we'll just not talk about that. Next up, what are we doing for book club this quarter? Going into a new year and a new decade, we've decided to mix things up a little bit with book club. So now instead of reading 12 books throughout the year, each quarter we'll be doing one book club, one movie night, and one game night. Exactly what that's going to look like is still a little bit up in the air. The book club will work how it always does. Movie night will be letting you know ahead of time what movie we'll be discussing and then jumping in and chatting about that instead of a book. Game night is going to be a little bit all over the place, trying a bunch of different things. Each quarter, it's going to be a lot of fun, maybe playing an RPG together or having some fun with all of you. We're going to play it by ear, but we're all really excited about this and it's going to be a fantastic 2020. In January, we will have our first ever Word Nerd Game Night. In February, we'll be talking about the Netflix movie adaptations of To All the Boys I've Loved Before, both the first and second movie. March is I Wish You All the Best by Mason Deaver. We each picked one book we're going to try and read this quarter. Mine is Pride and Prejudice by Jane Austen. One book I really want to read this quarter is going to throw my white balance extraordinarily off as soon as I hold it up, and that is Cursed by Frank Miller and Thomas Wheeler, which is a King Arthur retelling, except if a woman had pulled Excalibur out of the stone instead of King Arthur. One book that I cannot wait to read next quarter is our very own E. Latimer's The Witches of Ash and Ruin. I'm really looking forward this quarter to reading Trail of Lightning by Rebecca Roanhorse. I actually spent 10 minutes looking at my bookcase trying to figure out what I wanted to read in the first quarter of 2020 and I've got nothing so I could use some help from all of you. I'd love to hear in the comments what your favorite read of last year was and then hopefully I'll be able to pick one of those and add it to the top of my TBR. Let us know which books you're most looking forward to reading this quarter down in the comments. It's gonna be a great quarter!